go to the PuzzleScript website and click on make a game. Just have a look at how to load examples. You've got some very basic ones here. And then if you click run, you get both the crates onto the uh, targets, the level end. If you just go click on level editor, so up the top are all the different objects. You'll notice if you left click on the edges of the screen, you can make the world bigger. And if you right click, it will get smaller. Left clicking will also draw whatever tile that you have selected and right clicking will erase and put what's called the background. You can press this button here to build your level out and then it will give you this little diagram here. If you go down the left side of the screen where you've got all your code, it actually says legend. You can see the dots are the background, the hashtags are the wall. Highlight all this, right click copy. Scroll down to where it says levels. This is where we put our levels. If we just delete all the levels that were there previously and we can paste our level in. When you press run, the little title comes up and it says who it's by. You can change that if you go on the code and it's got title, a simple block pushing puzzle game. So now if we go run again, oh look, the text has changed in the game. You can go up here to save. And then if you go over here to where it says load, this will have all the different saves. So click on share and then it'll come up with these links to source code. So this one will just take you back to the source code. This one is the game. Paste that link in and it will be full screen and then you get that. If you want to get around that the level looking so giant like that, you can go back to your level editor and just make it bigger. You know, that looks a lot nicer. Now, if you want to take that a step further and say, put your game up on Newgrounds or something, click on export and you will get this little file down there. All you need is this file. Now I am doing a series. The next one's going to be on how to learn to start programming your own games. So I'll link to that in the description below. Thanks for watching. Look forward to seeing you guys again.